Hi viewers, this is D Srinivas in front of you. Today, I am going to discuss one important branch in mathematics that is geometry. That is called geometry. Very such a beautiful topic. I know, you know, most of the students might have been, it is toughest subject in their life. But geometry, if you know the basic concepts of geometry, this topic was very easy for you. Now, today we are going to discuss what is the important concepts about geometry from foot level to top level. I should give the clear information about geometry in my class. First of all, I should we should know what is geometry, what is plain geometry, first of all. Geometry have, it is a combination of two Greek words which are geo and metron. Geo means on earth. Now we are living now, it, it is earth. Metron means measurement. Simply we can say that earth measurement is called geometry. Yeah, geometry is nothing, it is not a separate, separate system. It is linking with our human life. It is around our around us. Example, you have to observe in the world, Babylonian civilization and the Hindu civilization. You should observe construction of roads, houses, drainage system and they have to paddy system, dam system. These are all are based on one such a beautiful objects are there. That is based on our geometry. So many world and Indian famous mathematician contributions there in that to develop it. But generally we can say that who is the father of geometry? Euclid only. Right? What is geometry? Let us go with, uh, discuss with the, some basic concepts of geometry which is helpful for you. What are the main four basic concepts are there in geometry first one is point only this is a basic concept point only point only next line line segment ray line line segment ray these are the four basic concepts we are going to discuss today what is point my point is what is point simple every students are saying that in by the textbook take the paper or pencil take one paper Put the pen or pencil nib on the paper, plot it. That marked point is called, we have to represent it by a dot. The dot, the dot is called here, we can say that point. point. In, the, in this paper, you represented a one dot. The dot also called as point, the name of point is A or B, whatever it is. But today, in my class, you have to know the one definition. Point is nothing but it is a basic geometrical concept which is does not have no length, no length, no breadth, no height, no length, no breadth, no height. That concept is the geometrical figure is called point. A point cannot be magnitude, no thickness. That is concept is called point. Means Point has no length, no breadth, no height. This is the definition of point. Next, points are denoted by capital letters only. Now, let us see. What is about line segment I am going to explain. I have a two points in a plane. The, the name of the points are, already I told you, points are denoted by capital letters only. These two points, the shortest distance, these two points. I am joining these two points like this curves. And I visualize this line also. The shortest distance between these two points, the shortest distance dis between these two points are called, we can consider is, it is called line segment. Line segment, line segment AB. It is done by AB line segment or a BA line segment. Shortest di distance between these two points, we should consider it. A B line segment. It is a line segment. A line segment also known as it is a fixed part of a line. Fixed part of a line. Fixed part of a line. This is fixed part. A line segment. One more definition I am giving now. Line segment is nothing but a, it is a fixed part of a line. It is denoted by A B line segment or B A line segment. A B line segment or B A line segment. It has. A line segment has two end points. It has two end points. Now it has no direction. 
very important notes i i am repeating now recap it a light has a fixed part of a line it has two end points no direction it is done by ab or ba line segment okay now we are going to discuss about line what is line we have to see line a simple a line is a a line is a straight path of a points it extends in both direction endlessly line is a straight path of points you join them it extends it extends in both direction endlessly then it is called line line the name of the line is l the name of the line is l we should denote it by line like this it extends on both direction endlessly we are going to discuss about plane what is plane simple we can say that plane plane everybody seeing everybody giving the plane definition like a sky like a uh, like a board like the, now like a building floor like this they are saying but particular definition of plane is a flat surface a flat surface like this i am drawing this a flat surface extends it extends in all direction equal manner a flat surface extends in all direction in equal manner then it is called a plane example of plane football example of plane is football and sky also right now plane tv monitor tv monitor also best example of plane tv monitor also best example of plane is a play we are going to last concept of this first class about geometry is ray ray is nothing but ray is nothing but it is defined by a part of a line it is defined by a part of a line it consists one initial point one endless point endless direction one initial point one endless direction means one direction only then it is called a ray a ray is nothing but part of a line it has it consists one initial point one endless direction now you see the diagram you can understand very easily you see the diagram you can imagine it very easily here initial point this is called ray yeah every student in your childhood days you have to draw the diagram like a hills one sunlight these are called hill one tree we can write like this no this is called example of ray you see this is also ray here this is called o this is called a direction denoted by ray o a ray denoted by ray o a ray and this is called initial initial point initial point and direction is one direction only it is going to one direction one arrow mark will be there no here two arrow marks will be there it is endless to two direction here one direction only. one direction then it is called a ray right now just we have to recap five seconds finger tip this class first basic geometric concept is point point is a geometrical concept does not have no length no breadth no height no length no breadth no height it is called point we have why capital letters now line segment line segment is nothing but a fixed part of a line fixed part of a line it has two end points it has two end points then it is called line segment line segment has no direction it is denoted by a b line segment b a it has two end points no direction now what about line line is a straight path of points straight path of point it extend endlessly in both direction then it is called line example line l denoted by l line now plane plane is i just to simplify a plot surface a plot surface it extend in all direction in equal manner uniform manner then it is called a plane example of plane football tv monitor right now ray ray is nothing but it is defined by defined as a part of a line it acts it a part of a line it consists one initial point one endless direction it is called ray this is the basic concept of geometry i hope you i assure it you have understood then next class i am going to explain one more such a beautiful geometry concept with diagrammatically keep learning thank you